Alright, welcome back everybody, and we are going to continue on. My plan was to go hunt for a bat horse, now that it's getting dark, and then we're going to venture over to the new... We need to find emeralds, for one, and for two, uh, I want to get some carrots and some potatoes from the villagers. So, first off, we're going to hunt around for some bad horses and I only have five arrows so I'm gonna have to make it count because I don't think I have any more material to make more arrows down here oh I can make one more ah one measly arrow okay and I'm just going to put this stuff in there oops I need the stick and then I'm going to get rid of all this extra inventory just to make it easier. Oh, it makes four. Okay. So the impression I would only have a few. Okay. So let's get to it. Hopefully, we get some spawning. Ah. I need to locate some food as well. I guess I don't have enough uh, light level around here. I'm gonna go in here and grab something for food. No, I can eat an apple. There we go. Just gonna run in here and uh, kill a cow. Oh, I just got. Okay, well. There we go. Okay, I don't want to waste too much time fiddling with food, so I'm just going to stick that in there right away. And I'm going to stick my leather in there for now, because I don't need it. I'm going to go back out here. Because bad horses only have a certain... Oh, perfect. There's lots of mob horses over here. Bad horses are only out during the night for a few minutes. And then... Okay, I didn't actually get any hearts of darkness or anything from either of those. The hearts of the undead, which is unfortunate. Um, let's see here. We got a wolf. Yeah, I don't see any bat horses, so I'm gonna not get eaten by a wolf. Okay. Oh, there's one over here. So I want to avoid all these scorpions if I can. And I want to get that bat horse. So I don't want to waste too many of my arrows. So I'm going to try and get a little closer without all these mobs noticing me. Alright, so. I move carefully, should be able to get through all these mobs without them noticing. That bad horse is way over there.
No, oh, okay, it's right almost above me. So these things are going to be pretty hard to... Oh, where'd it go? Oh, okay, it's right there. No, oh, missed him. Okay, whoops. Oh, I think he's right here. It's kind of hard to tell, so I'm going to get rid of this rat. Climb up here a bit. Oh. You guys just spawned there. Perfect. Oh, ah, goodness. Spider jockey. This knife is... <laughs> the sword isn't going to last much longer. Okay, I'm getting hit by a skeleton, but I'm not sure where it's coming from. It's coming from behind me. He's invisible! Okay, let me get out of here. See where the skeleton dude's coming from. I think it's this one. No, it's not. Okay, you know what? It's getting too hazardous. Okay. There was a zombie horse up there. Okay, I really don't know... Okay, let's try one more time to get up here. There's the zombie horse. He didn't drop anything either, so I'm going to go after that one. There we go. And I want to get this bat. There we go. No, oh, I'm out of arrows, darn it. Okay, it looks like he's landing, so I'm gonna go over here. We got a zombie villager. So it looks like the village has already been raided. Oh, and I didn't even get the chance. Whoa, okay. Die. Die. Can you please? Because I need to get over there to that bat horse before he des- Oh, he despawned already. Well then. It looks like, uh... Getting a bat horse is going to be quite a bit more difficult than we originally planned. But that's all part of the chase, I guess. So let's uh, go this way. We're going to get going to that village. We're going to leave the bat horse alone for now. We need to go get some food. And it looks like some of those horses are tame now. So I'm gonna grab my steak. I'm going to get rid of a few of these items that I don't really need right now. Okay, and I'm gonna have to take some items to trade. So I'm gonna take some wheat. 
And I'm not really sure what else they're going to want to trade me. So for now, I'll just, uh... I'll just go with this stuff for now. And hopefully, uh... They'll have some decent trades. Oh, and I'm going to take my bet. Alright. I'm going to let those horses keep going. Looks like they're done being tamed, but I'll leave them for now. And we're going to go to that beautiful desert. The desert village, and hopefully get some decent trades. Because if I remember correctly, Emerald only, like only, uh, will only spawn in some new and newly generated chunks. So this mountain system here is considered an old generation. So it's not going to spawn any emeralds for me. Oh hello little horsey. So to be able to get some emeralds I'm gonna have to go to a new mountainous biome. So for now I'm just gonna go see what they have to offer me first. Because if it's stuff that's going to be very useful, well, I'm going to go kill these cows. Then, obviously, it'll be worth coming back. Oh, three pork chops. Okay, continuing on, lots of squid over here. Like I said, once you don't need the animal anymore, lots of them spawn. Okay, so let's head on over this way. Into the land of the great unknown. Yeah, see, this isn't uh, a desert desert village either. Hopefully, we have some villagers left. Oh, there's one. Fourteen raw chicken, and you give me one emerald. It's a little pricey. One emerald, ten fruit. That's not bad. Fourteen chicken. You all want fourteen chicken for oh three emeralds for a pair of leather boots. One emerald for five glass. That's expensive. Ten arrows. That's not bad. One emerald. But I need emeralds for something other than there. We go. Eighteen. Bam. I was only gonna give me fifteen, so I have three emeralds now. So where's the dude with the cookies? Well, I don't really need cookies. I'll get the arrows. Okay. 